Peppa Pig Tales. Let's jump in! <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at a science museum. They are very excited to see an exhibit all about magnets. <laughs> oh, these aren't magnets. They're fish. The fish are made of metal, Peppa. So we can fish them out with these magnets. <gasps> Fishing rods. Just like on Grandpa Pig's boat. Just be careful. Magnets can be quite sticky. Phew. Peppa and George are catching lots of metal fish. And metal glasses. And metal keys. And all sorts of metal objects. Stop! Huh? May I have my watch back, please? Whoops! Sorry! So very much! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Bye! There we are. <laughs> oh, maybe not. <laughs> Use the magnets to race your magnetic slime to the end of the track. What magnetic slime? Maybe this button will give us the slime. Splat! <gasps> Magnets ready! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Steady, go! <laughs> the slime has little bits of metal in it, so it can stick to the magnets. I'm winning! I'm winning! <laughs> and the winner is... Oh! Uh... Um... I can't see who the winner is. <laughs> 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 what was that? Oh. <gasps> Look, George. Hmm. But what do pictures of us have to do with magnets? Hmm. Uh -huh. Aha. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> ah. The board uses magnets and little bits of metal, so you can draw on the pictures. How creative, George. Dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Daddy? I look great, Peppa. Ah, not again. <laughs> everyone loves learning about magnets at the Science Museum. Well, everyone except Daddy Pig. <laughs> Daddy Pig has to pick something up from work, so Peppa and George have come with him to his office. Sorry, Mr. Rabbit. Phew. <laughs> George really likes all the buttons in the lift. Oh. 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 oh dear, all that button pushing has broken the lift. Oh, whoopsie, George. Don't worry, George. I'm a bit of an expert at lifts, you know. Ah. Uh. The buttons in the lift aren't working. Hello. Welcome to the lift. <gasps> Is this lift magic? No. It's voice activated, which means we just have to tell it where to go. Much easier. Oh. <clears throat> Hello, lift. We would like to go to my office, please. The lift is working again. Okay. Yay! Floor two. Office of bees. But it hasn't <laughs> taken them to Daddy Pig's office. <laughs> no, not office of bees. Office, please. Floor six. <laughs> office cheese. <laughs> mm, I love cheese. <laughs> I said office. <laughs> Floor 16. A fish. <laughs> Silly magic lift. <laughs> the lift 
doesn't seem to understand Daddy Pig's voice. I'll try. Can we go to Daddy's job? Now arriving at the top. Um. <laughs> Not the top. Daddy's job, please. Peppa and her family keep trying to get to Daddy Pig's office. But the magic lift takes them to the wrong floors. <gasps> and spooky floors. Oh, hello. <laughs> and even party floors. <laughs> but none of them are the right floor until <gasps> my office. <laughs> Hello, Mummy Pig. We just had a little trouble with the lift. Be there soon. <laughs> Pepper and George really love the magic lift. Uh, uh, uh. But Daddy Pig much prefers to take the stage. <laughs> Today, Pepper and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars at Potato City. A new ride! It's a water ride! <laughs> it's so splashy! I love splashy rides! <laughs> splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves splashy rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride <laughs> without splashes? Like uh, oh, this bench! Ooh, what fun! Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. Come on, Mummy! <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery Stick Falls. Uh-oh! Stop! <laughs> oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. <laughs> Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, OK. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> oh. oh, this is quite lovely. <laughs> the ride is going very high up. Splash, splash, splash. We all love to splash. <laughs> Uh, not everyone loves to splash. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a humongous splash, please! Yeah! No. Okie dokie. Ready? Yeah! No. Five against one. Off you go! The celery stick falls are very fast. And very splashy. There we are, nice and dry. No, oh, not again. Yay! <laughs> Yay! That was amazing. <laughs> and very, very splashy. <laughs> Mummy, what are you doing? The splashes were amazing. Let's go again. Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. Today, Peppa and George have come to play in a special bouncy maze. We're in a bit of a rush. So quick as you can, please. Yay! Bye, Bye. Mummy. And don't get lost. The first room has a big bouncy castle inside. Nay! Hello! Nay! <laughs> Sorry, we can't play. We're in a bit of a rush. Come on, George. Pepper has gone through the blue exit. But George has gone through the red one by mistake. This room has a soft tunnel with Susie sheep inside. Hi, Susie. Me and George 
Crunch have to go fast because we're in a rush. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Oh, George. This room <gasps> is extra bouncy. Hi, Rebecca. Is this the way out? We're in a rush. Yes. <laughs> Through there. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Hooray. We found the way out. Well done, Pepper. But where's George? I thought he was behind me. Maybe he's lost in the maze. <gasps> lost? We have to find him. Whee! George isn't lost. He's just having lots of fun. <laughs> Do you know where George is? <laughs> he went that way. But Mummy Pig is not as good at bouncing as Pepper. We're coming, George! <laughs> oh. It's okay, Mummy. Falling is just as fun as bouncing. Whee! Whee! <laughs> hmm. Um. <gasps> there he is! We're coming, George! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Uh -huh. Hooray! We found you! Phew! It's time for us to go home! No! George doesn't want to go home. He's having lots of fun in the bouncy maze. Well, then we'll have to... Come and get you! Peppa and George love playing in the bouncy maze. We got you! I won't ever lose you again! Look out below! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> now we really have to go. And so does <laughs> Mummy Pig. Dinosaur. Today, Dinosaur. Mummy Pig has brought Dinosaur. Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello, I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy! Ooh! Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. A spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Peppa and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic... <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> There are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh yes! Ah oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. Flight <laughs> <laughs> egg is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow! What is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? <gasps> Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> Whee! <gasps> and so are you! 
Peppa and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Today is Pancake Day. So Peppa and her family are eating at a fancy pancake restaurant. Hello, I'll be your chef today. I make the pancakes right at your table and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. One banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up. Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. Ooh! And now for the best <laughs> bit. Smelling. Eating. <laughs> Flipping it. Exactly. Woohoo! Miss Rabbit is very good at making pancakes. <laughs> Yay! Mmm! Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please! <laughs> you clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh! Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut. Cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Peppa. <laughs> Peppa and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes and lots of them. Ta-da! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two... Flip! Peppa and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa. very high and onto <laughs> Mr Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm, tar very much. Mmm, it's sweet mm. and savoury, crunchy and ooh, spicy. Oh. Ooh, delicious! Oh. <laughs> It's a special surprise pancake. Oh, mm. pancake? <laughs> Peppa and George love making super special surprise pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. <laughs> Hello! Peppa and her family are ordering lunch at a sandwich shop. Peppa, we don't order at the counter in this sandwich shop. No, we yes. order at the special screens. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Why don't you have a go at ordering a sandwich, Peppa? <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> you can select different toppings for your baguette by pressing the pictures. I'm very hungry. <laughs> I want a really big, long baguette, please. Lettuce, tomato, and lot of cheese! Peppa is adding lots of cheese, and her sandwich is getting bigger and bigger. I know you're hungry, Peppa. But that might be a bit too much cheese. Oh, <laughs> OK. Now press the send button so the chef can make your order. The chefs have received Peppa's order from the machine and are hard at work making it. It looks so yummy and cheesy. Now it's George's turn to pick his sandwich. <laughs> Look, that children's meal comes with a special surprise. George can't wait for his special surprise. Now it's Mummy Pig's turn to order. I'll just have my usual. Tomato and mushroom with six pickled onions, two cheese slices, olives, no cucumber, half a red pepper and a sprinkle of chilli sauce and a whole wheat poppy seed baguette. 
Um, did you say cucumber? No, no, George, no! Uh oh! George, no! I suppose it's always good to try new things. Peppa and George are enjoying their lunch while they wait for Mummy's extra special sandwich. It's very cheesy. <gasps> Dinosaur! Surprise! Mummy Pig's sandwich is being made. It's a bit bigger than she expected. Uh... It's ready, Mummy. Oh, how, um, big. I don't think I can eat all this on my own. Would you like some? Oh, it's a bit spicy. Mmm, but very tasty. Mm. I might have a new favourite. Everyone <laughs> loves their sandwiches, even if they aren't exactly what they meant to order. Huh. Uh. <laughs> wow! Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. Well done! You got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens! <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Peppa. Mummy Pig is showing Peppa how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please. Daddy? Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow. I'm a bit of an expert at dancing, you know. Your turn, Peppa. <laughs> I know just the game. <laughs> Peppa and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. Did we get another high score? Yes, your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Let's go! Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? Of course. With this many tokens, you can get a marvellous, extraordinary, one-of-a-kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade. And Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. Yay! But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Peppa. We need to decorate it first. Follow me! Hooray! 
Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Peppa. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate oh. harden into bars. And done. Yay! Oh. Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. <gasps> Hmm, is something wrong, Peppa? No, I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Oh, oh. then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all. It's... <laughs> a chocolate fountain! It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice healthy fruit to dip too. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Peppa loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello, everyone. Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? Ooh. Oh, what happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice, relaxing drive. Oh dear! Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race! So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs! <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check! Then off we go! Oh. <laughs> Whoops! Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus oh. is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. can do lots of things. It can do this, this, oh. this, oh. and of course this. Yeah. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madame Gazelle. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round all day long. <laughs> Let's play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye something beginning with R. Nope, it's a really big lorry. Oh, hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh, I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry, 
I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madam Gazelle. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Yay! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! And it's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> Look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Yay! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone loves the fun house because the fun house is very... Hello. Hi. Peppa and her family have come to the balloon shop to collect a special balloon for a garden party. Miss Rabbit, can we have our fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloon? Whoa. Oh. Wow. Balloon! The balloon shop is full of balloons. Miss Rabbit? <laughs> Bonk! Oh. <laughs> Bonk! Oh, you found me! I've been lost in the balloon since Tuesday morning. Must be lunchtime by now. It's Wednesday, Miss Rabbit. Oh. Anyway, here are all your fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloons. <laughs> ready for the party. All? But we only ordered one. Hmm. Whoa! Um, it says here, 1,000 balloons for Mummy Pig's party. Oh, but we don't need this many and we can't waste them. What do we do? I know. We can share them. Peppa and her family are giving One, the extra two. balloons to everyone in One town. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and one for both of you. Here you go. Red balloon. Green one for you. <laughs> <sighs> Only 992 to go. This is going to take forever. Uh-oh, and we have to go and set up the party. I have a great idea. Grab some balloons and follow me, everyone. Hooray! <laughs> 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 it is time for the party, and everyone is beginning to arrive. <laughs> Hello, Susie. Here's your balloon. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Bonk. <laughs> Bonk. Oh, 
<laughs> Miss Rabbit has used the balloons to turn the garden party into a balloon party. Miss Rabbit can make anything with a balloon. <laughs> or anyone. Here you go. <laughs> it looks like me. And this one looks like me. <laughs> this is the balloon ray. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, Daddy. <laughs> and don't worry if you pop a balloon, because we have lots of extras. Bonk. <gasps> Bonk! <laughs> Bonk! Bonk! Everyone would have loved Mummy Pig's garden party, but everyone loves the balloon party even more. <laughs> are volcanoes real, Madam Gazelle? They are. Ooh. But do not worry, children. There are no volcanoes close by. Except the little pretend ones that we are going to make for today's very special science experiment. Oh! We will make our volcanoes using glue and newspaper. Like this. First you dip the paper in the glue, and then you stick it all to the beaker, and voila! A volcano! Everyone is enjoying making their volcanoes. The glue is very sticky and messy. <laughs> and soon they are all finished. <laughs> Wonderful, children. Now it is time to paint your creations. <laughs> Let's make ours red, Peppa. <laughs> ours can be blue. Green, like a big tree. Real volcanoes are dark and grey with red lava. <laughs> But Peppa and her friends are making their mini volcanoes bright and colourful. <gasps> now it is time for the science experiment. But first, everyone must put on special gloves, glasses and coats to make sure they are safe. You all look like wonderful scientists, children. Now, we are ready to make lava. <gasps> but do not worry. The lava we are making is just pretend and very safe. <laughs> First, we add some vinegar to our volcanoes. Be careful not to spill. Uh, uh, <gasps> Perfect. And now, I will add a secret magic ingredient to each of your volcanoes. Nobody knows what the special magic ingredient is. Finally, take your cup of baking soda and pour a little inside the volcano. Then stand back. Madame Gazelle's volcano is erupting, just like a real volcano. Your turn, children. Hooray! <laughs> wow! The lava is red. Ours is blue. Candy Cat and Gerald Giraffe's lava is green and very foamy. I think we made too much lava. No, Candy, you made a muddy puddle. Everyone loves making volcanoes, but everyone really loves making colourful muddy puddles. Today, Peppa is playing with her toy blocks. <gasps> Oop! Careful, George. This is a very small town and you're a very giant dinosaur. That gives me an idea. Do you want to play giants, George? <laughs> George is very excited to play giants with Peppa. <laughs> Hello, Police Officer Panda. What a lovely, quiet, normal day in Toyland. <laughs> and definitely no sign of... <gasps> Hello, I am Giant Pepper. <gasps> a giant! 
two giants. <laughs> Peppa and George are imagining their giants in a pretend <laughs> toy block world. Hello, birds. Hello, clouds. <laughs> Hello, everyone. <gasps> Bear, our ball is stuck in that very tall tree. We can help you with that. We are very tall giants. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, careful, George. <laughs> there you go, Susie. <laughs> Hooray! Giant Pepper and Giant George <laughs> love to help their friends in Toyland. <gasps> They help the passengers Whee! to get on the bus. Oh, wee! <laughs> wee! Wee! <laughs> and help the boats go very, very fast. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> it's the bridge you broke earlier. Oh. Don't worry. We can fix it. <laughs> Peppa and George are experts with toy blocks. They fix the toy bridge in no time at all. Thanks, Giant Peppa and Giant George. Stop! Uh, I mean, go! Hooray! 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 Oh, goody! Hungry. I'm hungry too. The food in Toyland is too small for Giant Pepper and Giant George. Whoa! Dinner time! Hooray! So they will have to have real food instead. Careful, George! <laughs> Welcome oh. to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day. So Pepper and George are playing ice cream shop. <laughs> Here you go, Mr. Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs. Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Oh. Ooh. What's a banana split, Granny? <laughs> it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Now we add ice cream cherries and whipped cream. Ah. George <laughs> likes adding the ice cream. Careful, don't squish the banana. <laughs> <laughs> and Peppa really likes adding whipped cream. Don't forget ah. the cherry on top. Here is your banana split, Mrs. Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have a Knickerbocker Glory? Uh -huh. A Knockanori? What's that, madam? Ho, ho, ho. Uh -huh. It's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Oh. <laughs> Not that type of Sunday. You can eat them any time. Ah. I'll show you. Uh -huh. We need ice cream, fruit, meringue and cream. <laughs> Peppa and George add all the ingredients into the glass. Oh. And now you can decorate the top. Yay. Then decorate with wafers, colourful sprinkles and sauce. Here you are, ah, madam. This looks wonderful. Now <laughs> everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm, a rainbow <laughs> one. Rainbow. Pepper and George use lots of different <laughs> coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for <laughs> banana. Nana. Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Pepper and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a muddy puddle. Ah. Not rainbow ice cream. 
I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is vanilla. My favorite. <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. Squish! Today, Peppa and her playgroup are at a juice factory. They're learning how juice is made. And this is the fruit squeezer. It squeezes all the juice out of the oranges. Can I try squeezing oranges, Miss Rabbit? Of course. You can all try. Hooray! Everyone is having lots of fun squeezing the oranges. But it is very hard work. <laughs> My hands are tired. That's OK, because next up, we have the juice stomper. Oh. The stomper has big boots to stomp out all the juice from the strawberries. Oh, can I try stomping, Miss Rabbit? Yes, everyone can try. Hooray! Pop these boots on and stomp away. <laughs> It's just like jumping in muddy puddles. Well done, everyone. Now, follow me. This is where the juice is put into cartons. We have to match the flavour with the picture on the cartons. What flavour is this one? It's red. Is it strawberry? Well done, Mandy. Press the red button to fill it up. And how about this one? It's green. So... Apple! <laughs> Spot on, Susie. And this one? It's mm. lots of colours. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Peppa. You've created mm -hmm. a brand new type of juice. It's rainbow juice. <laughs> Everyone thinks the rainbow juice looks very delicious indeed. This is the tasting room. It's where we make sure all the juice tastes scrum diddly umptious. But to make it fun, you have to guess what flavour each juice is. Pepper and her playgroup love tasting <laughs> juice. This is orange uh -huh. juice. Mmm. <laughs> this is apple juice. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This tastes like all the juices at once. That's because it's your special rainbow <gasps> juice. Yum, yum, yum. Pepper loves learning about juice. And Peppa really loves her delicious rainbow juice. Today, Peppa and George are helping Daddy Pig tidy some old boxes. <laughs> What's this, Daddy? Ah, that's my trusty old camera, Peppa. You press the button to take a picture. Cheese! And it prints the photo out. Look, I can see it. Can I have a go, please? <laughs> Say cheese! Cheese! Now Peppa is taking photos with the camera. This camera is really fun. Camera! <laughs> have fun! But there isn't much photo paper left, so use it wisely. George loves taking lots of photos. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it's run out of photo paper. Oh, but I love taking pictures. Hmm. Why don't we use my phone's camera instead? It can even add filters to a photo. <laughs> Daddy Pig's phone camera has given George a pretend moustache. <laughs> Come on, George. Let's take more photos. Peppa and George are having lots of fun taking pictures. The phone camera has given Mummy Pig a flowery filter. Say cheese. Oh.
And Grandpa Pig has a very fine hat. <laughs> Pepper, George and Daddy Pig have come to the park to take even more photos. <laughs> Hello, Mr and Mrs Bird. Cheese! Whoa. 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 <laughs> what a funny photo! Daddy Pig wants to take a photo with Pepper and George <laughs> by the ducks. Say cheese, everybody! One, two, three, cheese! <laughs> <laughs> Pepper and George are sticking all the photos from the day into a scrapbook. Look at this one, George. But some of the photos are blurry. Oh. The photos don't have to be perfect. They just have to remind you of a lovely day. Everyone loves taking photos. And everyone has had a very lovely day. <laughs> Hi. Today, Peppa is going to Rebecca Rabbit's bar. Bye, Mummy. Oh. <laughs> Today, Peppa is already at Rebecca Rabbit's burrow. She's come to play a new Whoa. video game called... Carrot Catcher! Do you want to play? Yes, please. I'm amazingly, really excellent at games. Oh, dear. Peppa doesn't know how to begin the game. Um, I am amazingly, really excellent at games. But maybe it would be more fun if you started the game, Rebecca. <laughs> oh, yes. I knew that. <laughs> First, you pick your bunny. Then you hop around and catch the carrots. Oh, yes. Um... Uh, uh. Peppa is amazingly really excellent at video games, but she might need a bit of help with this one. How do you catch the carrots, please, Rebecca? Like this! <gasps> Yay! I'm good at this. <laughs> oh. My turn! <laughs> wow! Rebecca Rabbit is amazingly really excellent at this game. Wow! You're really good at catching carrots, Rebecca. <laughs> I've had lots of practice. Do you want to play together now? We can be a team. <gasps> yes! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Got it! Yay! Here's one! There's one! Whee! Mm, <laughs> <laughs> New high score! Hooray! Peppa and Rebecca <laughs> make a very good team. Rosie, Robbie, what are you doing? <laughs> Hello, you two. Have you seen the twins? They've run off with our lunch. <gasps> we'll catch them. We're good at catching carrots. <laughs> and baby bunnies. <laughs> <laughs> Found one. Rosie. <laughs> gotcha. Here's another one! Robbie! Got it! Mmm, still good! Pepper and Rebecca are very good carrot catchers. Yay! Hooray! Lunch is saved! See you! In fact, Pepper and Rebecca are amazingly, really excellent carrot catchers. Four tickets, please! Four popcorns, please. Four drinks, please. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the cinema. Peppa's favourite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly 
George. We're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary <laughs> ghost movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, oh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. me. Uh, oh. Sorry. <sighs> <sighs> the seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me, coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whoosh, whoosh. Yay, it's starting! <gasps> Sorry! <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. Oh dear, George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh! Pepper has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George, it's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not Scary? No. And this magic wand oh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> Wish! <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh! Happy! <laughs> Wish! <gasps> Sorry. Everyone loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. Today, Mummy and Peppa have brought George to the doctors for a checkup. Hello, I'm Dr. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George <gasps> has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr. Brown Bear need to check George's height. Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. You'll be a big grown-up soon. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall too. Wow, you're so big and tall, George. <laughs> now it's time to check George's weight <gasps> with a special machine called scales. <gasps> this machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good <laughs> for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> and freeze! <gasps> mm -hmm. And unfreeze! <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a stethoscope. Oh. <gasps> This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh. Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. 
George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> oh. <laughs> and one for Dr Peppa Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Well done, Mandy. Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a <laughs> special surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Whoa. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur. Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Peppa's <laughs> token makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Peppa hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mummy? Please! <laughs> oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. Oh. oh dear, I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to <gasps> worry, Mummy Pig, I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope, nope. Screwdriver! <gasps> ah, oh, thank you, George. <gasps> <gasps> Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine and George really loves dinosaurs. Today, Peppa and George are playing grown-ups. Oh gosh, oh gosh, where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. Uh, 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 all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? <laughs> Silly George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. They go to Dr Hamster the vet. But you can have a sticker anyway. 
think you'd make a very good dentist. Dinosaur! <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, the <laughs> park. Stop! You forgot us! Come back! <laughs> vroom! Vroom! <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. <laughs> then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> <laughs> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always <laughs> love jumping in muddy puddles, <laughs> even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. <laughs> Peppa and her family have bought lots of food at the supermarket. And now they have very rumbly tummies. <laughs> What's for dinner? My tummy's making lots of noises. Tonight we're making tacos. Yay! What's a taco? And how do you make them? <laughs> it's a delicious food from Mexico. And the best way to make tacos is all together. <laughs> Pepper, George and Mummy Pig are washing vegetables for their tacos. Let's make sure the vegetables are nice and clean. Splish, splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies clean. Splish. Splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies. <laughs> splash, 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 splash. Now, Pepper and Mummy Pig are nice and clean too. Now the vegetables are clean, we can carefully slice some onions. Here you go, Daddy. <laughs> What's wrong, Daddy? Don't you like onions? Oh, don't worry, Pepper. The juice from the onion sometimes makes your eyes water. I just need something to cover my eyes. I know. Pepper knows a perfect way to protect their eyes from the onions. These are perfect, Pepper. Ah, onions again, Daddy Pig. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll make some guacamole. Hooray! I love guacamole. Then you can mash the avocado, Pepper. Pepper likes <laughs> mashing the avocado. It's very fun and messy. Oops! <laughs> Perhaps try a bit more gently, Pepper. Perfect! Now we mix in other ingredients. And add a very special squeeze of lime. Squeeze! <laughs> All right, George. You can add the special squeeze. Yay! Oh, it's a good job I'm wearing my safety goggles. <laughs> now all the ingredients are ready, it's time to put the tacos together. This is the best bit. Take your tortilla, like this. And add your favourite ingredients. Peppa likes her taco with lots of guacamole. George likes his taco empty. Mummy and Daddy Pig like their tacos with everything. Mm. Everyone thinks that tacos are very tasty. <gasps> but they've all dropped their filling. Hooray! Now we can put them together again. <laughs> <laughs> a super strike for a super bowler. Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> 
to get a super strike too. I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa. OK. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. Ooh. Now you shoot the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead, like this. Yay! 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 <laughs> I'm going to try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one instead. It's lighter. Whoa! Crikey! Anyone lost a ball? Oh, no. I'll try next. Oh! Pedro Pony's ball has gone into the gutter at the side of the lane. Whoops! My turn. Whoa! Susie Sheep, Pedro Pony and Gerald Giraffe haven't quite got the hang of bowling yet. Don't worry. We need to find a better way to play. Hmm. Why don't you try with the barriers up this time? It's another fun way to play. Now you try, Pedro. OK, but I don't want my bowling ball to bounce. No problem. You can use a ramp to help the ball roll in a straight line. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Peppa and her friends are having lots of fun bowling in their own ways. <laughs> but Susie Sheep still wants to get a super strike. All right, everyone. It's your last bowl. Good luck. <laughs> What's this? Susie Sheep is bowling backwards. Oh! A super strike for a super bowler! Susie Sheep has got a super strike. Susie Sheep loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. <laughs> Yummy, tasty food. Yummy, tasty food. Today on the cruise, Peppa and her family are at a very special type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, oh goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Peppa? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? <laughs> I think we can rustle up some orange juice. <laughs> Let's see here. Aha! Ooh. The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. Juice! We'll just have to make some more. Delicious! I can't wait to... Finished! Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Pepper. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right away. Ooh. Pepper has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid. 
Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited ah. to eat her spaghetti. Ah! Finish. Oh! Thank you, Pancake Robot. But now Pepper is thirsty mm. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's ah. taking him so long. Mmm. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a cup of orange juice. In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. Oh. The machine has finally stopped oh. making orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa. You don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Peppa loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the botanical garden. <laughs> this one's tall. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <gasps> These smell lovely. <laughs> Ooh, and that one is on Daddy's oh. head. <laughs> <laughs> Step right up to the very tricky hedge maze. Enter if you dare. What's this, Miss Rabbit? This is a very tricky hedge maze. It's a long, windy path with lots of twisty turns. You have to find the big fountain oh. in the middle. Peppa and George like the sound of the very <laughs> tricky maze. I'm a bit of an expert at mazes. I almost never get lost. <laughs> Good luck! Let's go! Hooray! Peppa and her family are making their way through the maze. It is very windy. Oh! <laughs> 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 Everyone thinks it is very fun indeed. There's nowhere to go. Oh dear. We'll have to go back and try another way, Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig? <gasps> Over here, Mummy Pig. George and I must have taken a wrong turn. Uh oh. Perhaps we should meet at the fountain in the middle. Good idea. <laughs> Race you! <laughs> Look, oh. Mummy, more tall flowers. And little ones. <laughs> Peppa and Mummy Pig are having lots of fun in the maze, but Daddy and George are a bit lost. Hmm? <sighs> Not to worry, George. We'll make it as long as we don't give up. Oh, hello, huh? George. The fountain is that way, by the big leafy flowers. Hooray! Off we go! Everyone has arrived at the centre of the maze. Hooray! Well done. You finished the first <gasps> bit of the maze oh. very quickly. What's the second bit? Finding your way out, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and her family loved going into the very tricky hedge maze and they're really going to love finding their way out again too. The treasure train is on its way. Choo-choo! <laughs> Yay! Peppa Pig and Danny Dog are driving a train full of gold. Silver and... Broccoli! <laughs> Is broccoli treasure? Yes. It's special broccoli made of sparkly diamonds. Peppa and Danny aren't really driving a train. They're using their imagination to pretend. Hooray! Stop! <gasps> In the name of... Um... Robbers! <gasps> oh no! Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are pretending to be train robbers. Can we have all your treasure, please? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're supposed to steal the treasure, Susie. 
Now, Peppa and Danny are pretending to be police officers. They're going to catch the robbers. Hey. You caught us. No, we didn't. Because, um... Ha! Your mm. boat can fly. Whoa. Um, Madame Gazelle, can ships fly? Real ships cannot fly. Oh. But pretend ships... Certainly can. Hooray! Wow! Now Pedro and Susie are in a flying boat. Oh, um. <gasps> Our train can fly too. Whee! <laughs> uh oh! Hey! Police officers Pepper and Danny have almost caught the robbers. Daddy Pig! And he's coming to take you home! <laughs> Charge! Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? We're pretending to fly our boats and trains, Daddy! <laughs> oh my! What an imaginative bunch you all are! Oh! Aha! Peppa loves imagining things! Everyone loves imagining things. Today, Peppa and her friends are at the park. They're about to have a scooter race. First to that tree is the winner. Ready? Steady. Go! <gasps> My wheel fell off. Oh, dear. Oh, excuse me, Mr Bull. Do you know how to fix my scooter, please? Oh, I definitely do. I know about lots about scooters. <laughs> Mr Bull does mm. not know lots about scooters. Hmm, that doesn't seem right. Don't worry, I'm a bit of an expert at scooters. Daddy does know lots about scooters. Ta-da! <laughs> oh, good old. Do you want to race scooters with us, Mr Bull? Um, well, the reason I don't know a lot about scooters is because I've never ridden one before. <gasps> but it's so fun! Ooh. Yeah, you can go really fast. And it's much better than walking. Oh, my. That does sound fun when you put it like that. We'll teach you. Just put one foot on the scooter and push forward, like this. Seems simple enough. <gasps> Remember to push forward, Mr Bull. <laughs> hey, look at me! I'm scootering! Wahey! Yeah! <laughs> With the handlebars. You mean like this? Whee! Yes! <laughs> yeah! 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 Whoa! Oh, no! Mr. Bull doesn't know how to slow down. How do I stop? You need to use the brake, Mr. Bull. Brake? This bit? <laughs> Oh, my! How fun! I want to ride down the hill again! Yay! Yay! Scootering is so much more fun than walking! <laughs> Whee! 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 Pepper and Mr Bull are tired from going up the hill. <gasps> Going uphill is a bit more work than going down. Maybe I should go downhill again. Good idea. Whee! Mr Bull loves riding scooters. Yeah! Everyone loves riding scooters. Whee! 
It is bedtime. But George isn't sleeping. So neither are Pepper or Daddy Pig. What now? We've already read every bedtime story. There is one book we haven't read. I've been saving it for an emergency. The very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. The very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep? Yes, the very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. Once upon a time, there was a hero named... Super Pepper! <laughs> um, yes, Super Pepper. Whee! She spent all her days helping the people in her neighborhood. Uh-oh. <laughs> Until... One day, she heard about a jumping giant who wouldn't stop shaking the town. The giant won't stop jumping. I'll help you. Super Pepper found the jumping <laughs> giant. Dinosaur. Oh, yes, George, the jumping dinosaur. Super Pepper tried everything she could to stop the jumping dinosaur from jumping. Like asking him very politely? Yes. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Mr. Dinosaur, sir. Excuse me. They tried some bedtime music. This will put him to sleep. <sighs> so relaxing. But the music only gave the dinosaur more energy. Super Pepper tried giving the jumping dinosaur a warm bath. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. She tried giving him cozy pajamas. She even tried counting stars. One, two, three, four, five. That's everything we did. There's nothing left to try. <sighs> The bedtime story has helped George fall asleep. Hooray! Thank you for your help, Pepper. Sweet dreams. Thank you, Daddy Bert. Now I'm not tired. Can you finish the story? Peppa Pig and her friends are at the aquarium today. They're all pretending to be fish. Meow, <laughs> what's that? <gasps> this is an octopus. It has eight long wibbly wobbly legs. Ooh. Actually, an octopus only has two wibbly wobbly legs. The other six are wibbly wobbly arms. Rip wobb, rip <laughs> wow! I wish I had a rainbow tail. <gasps> Let's be mermaids, Susie! <laughs> but we don't have mermaid tails. But we can pretend! <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Peppa Whee! and Susie are pretending they are mermaids with long, lovely tails. Hello, seahorses! We can swim around just like you! <laughs> Whee! Whee! <gasps> it's so pretty! What is it? This is an oyster. <laughs> it has a pearl inside. <gasps> a pearl? What's a pearl? It's a very lovely, shiny object. Can we open it and see it? An oyster only opens when it's ready, so we'll just have to be patient. Hmm. I can't see the pearl. Excuse me, Mr Oyster. Can you open, please? We're being really patient. <laughs> Can you go, ah, uh, like at the dentist? Hmm. Um... <gasps> <laughs> oh, it's not working. <gasps> it's so tickly. <laughs> Let's tickle it open. Mermaid Pepper 
and Mermaid Susie are trying to tickle the oyster so it'll open. They tickle and tickle and tickle, but the oysters still won't open. It's not working. We'll never see the pearl. We'll just have to wait. <gasps> it's the pearl! It's so pretty! <laughs> the oyster has finally opened. The pearl inside is very lovely indeed. Aww. Rip wob, rip wob! But I want to see the pearl. Can we make it open, please? <laughs> no, Danny. Oh. We have to be patient. Everyone knows that being patient can be tricky, but Peppa and Susie know that the very lovely pearl will be worth the wait. <laughs> Peppa, have you decided what you're giving away to the charity shop? Yes, all of this. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa is giving some of her toys and clothes to a charity shop. This is called donating. <gasps> Away we go! Whee! <laughs> charity shops sell donated items Aww. and use the money to help people. Great! Do you want to help me sell them? Yes, please! I'll help by shopping. <laughs> Peppa is excited for people to buy her old things. <gasps> oh. But no one is buying them. No one is buying any of the things I donated, Miss Rabbit. Not to worry. We just need to let people know they're available to buy. <laughs> like this. Do you like <gasps> toy rabbits, Police Officer Panda? Yes. Did you want to buy this one? <gasps> I do. <gasps> Thank you. Why don't you try, Peppa? <gasps> I'm a bit cold, <gasps> Mummy. Would you like to buy this jumper, Susie? It's very warm and woolly <laughs> and cosy. <laughs> yes. Please, I love wool. Bonjour, Miss Rabbit. I'm looking for a gift for somebody <gasps> who loves sports. Hmm. I know. Hmm. <gasps> Catch. Oh, this is perfect. Thank you. Oh. Peppa wants to sell her <laughs> toy bus next. But there's no one left to sell to. There's no one left in the shop, Miss Rabbit, mm -hmm. except <gasps> Mummy. Let's put it in the window display so everyone outside can see it. Yay! <coughs> Hello there. Look at this toy bus. Would you like to buy it? No one can hear Peppa from outside the shop. <gasps> The big real bus looks just like Peppa's little toy bus. <gasps> we have the same bus. Oh. Maybe it'll sell tomorrow, Peppa. <gasps> Yay! Excuse me, is that toy bus for sale? <gasps> Why, yes it is. Would you like to buy it? I would love to buy it. I love all buses, big and small. Hooray! Peppa loves the charity shop. Everyone <gasps> loves the charity shop. <laughs> Peppa and Rebecca Rabbit are making a pillow fort today. Careful, don't fall on the fort. Almost got it. Whoa! Squeak! We did it. Now we need to decorate the inside. <gasps> hmm, something else is missing. Oh, oh something, something to eat! eat. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy! What a beautiful pillow fort! Can we have something to eat, please? Of course, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. 
Let's pretend the pillow fort is really big inside. <coughs> wow! <laughs> Catch, Peppa! <laughs> Let's pretend the floor is really bouncy, like a trampoline. Squeak! <laughs> it's so bouncy! <laughs> The ball bounced over there. Let's bounce after it. Uh, uh. This floor is green, so let's pretend it's squelchy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the ball isn't here. Maybe over there. <laughs> <laughs> this room is blue, so let's pretend it's... Cold! <laughs> There's the ball. Hooray! L let's get out of here. Um, which way did we c come in? Peppa, where are you? We're lost in the pillow fort. I'll come get you. No, Mummy. The fort isn't built for grown-ups. Oh, I can fit through anything. Uh, uh. Mummy Pig is stuck. Oh. Uh, uh. Mummy, your wiggles are breaking the fort. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Phew. All that pretending has made me even more hungry. Good thing I brought you some food. Now, we just need to find it under these pillows. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends are at the water park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Miss, Miss Rabbit. Rabbit. Before you all go swimming, I have some important rules to teach you. Miss Rabbit is telling everyone how to be safe in the swimming pool. The first rule is no splashing. <laughs> no splashing, Mr Bull. Whoops! Sorry, Peppa. Sorry, Miss Rabbit. That's OK, Mr Bull. The second rule is no running. <laughs> <laughs> Silly Mr Bull, no running. Sorry again. Mr Bull doesn't know any of the rules. And the last rule is, everyone must have a simply splendid time. Oh! Ooh. Have a splendid time, Mr Bull. Oh, ho, ho, ho. right you are, Pepper. Enjoy the pool, everyone. What shall we do first? Let's go on the water slide. Oh. Hooray! Everyone is very excited to ride the water slides. <laughs> Hello again. Who wants to go down the slide? Me! <laughs> well, you're in luck. There is one slide for each of you. Let's have a race. Good idea. Lucky I brought my flag. On your marks, get set, go. And Danny Dog zooms into the lead, followed by Peppa. Then it's Gerald Giraffe and Susie Sheep coming up behind. It's incredibly close. Water slide racing at its best. Hello, Granny. Hello, Mr. Bull. Oh. <laughs> They're nearly at the finish line. It's neck and neck. Who will come out on top? It's a draw. Everybody wins! Peppa and her friends love the slides, 
but they have forgotten the first rule of the water park. Oh. Uh -huh. <coughs> no splashing. <laughs> It is dinner time, but dinner has been burned. Oh dear, do you think we can still eat it? <laughs> I think we should treat ourselves to a takeaway. Hooray! We choose what kind of food we like and it gets delivered to our house. There's Chinese takeaway, Indian takeaway or sushi. Can we have this one please? Peppa wants to order Chinese takeaway. Let's have this and this. And don't forget the special surprise. Ah. Peppa and her family have ordered lots of delicious food. <laughs> what happens now? Well, first the restaurant has to cook the food and then they'll deliver it. Oh, but how do they know where we live? I gave them our address when we ordered the takeaway. But how will it get here? Miss Rabbit will bring it on her bike. Oh, look! She's nearly here. Let's go and find her. <laughs> huh? Pepper and George have gone to the wrong door. Oh! oh. It's here! It's here. <laughs> Here's your takeaway, Pepper. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Got to dash. Lots of food to deliver. Rice, noodles, vegetable rolls. And a special Ooh. surprise for afterwards. Yay. Pepper and George don't know what the special <laughs> surprise is. Mmm, I love rice. Mmm. Mm. And I love my spicy noodles. They're my favourite. They might be my favourite too. Can I try some? Yes, but just try a tiny bit. Mmm, I love noodles. Oh, but they are a bit spicy. Spicy ow, noodles ow, ow, ow. are not Pepper's <laughs> favourite. Here, try a vegetable spring roll. Mmm, <laughs> vegetable spring rolls are my favourite. <laughs> Peppa and her family have finished their Chinese takeaway. Are you ready for the special surprise? Hooray! These are called fortune cookies. They have a special message inside that brings you good luck. Ooh. This good luck tastes amazing. Peppa loves Chinese takeaway. <laughs> Everyone loves Chinese takeaway. Oh dear. There, there. Today, Peppa has found a video <gasps> of when she was a baby. <laughs> I was a very loud baby, wasn't I, Daddy? Ho, ho. Yes, all babies are sometimes. Gosh, oh. that must have been when I was pregnant with George. Pregnant? What does that mean? <laughs> that means he was still in my tummy. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? Look, now there's a baby in my tummy too. Oh, <laughs> very good, Peppa. Now, what do people with babies in their tummies do? Hmm, I used to get lots of funny cravings, which are when you really want to eat certain foods. Mm, mm, yum! Peppa has decided she has a craving too. I really want to eat... Oh! Spaghetti! <laughs> Peppa thinks cravings are delicious. <laughs> <laughs> ah! That was very yummy. <laughs> what else happens when you have a baby in your tummy, Mummy? Well, I'd get tired a lot. So kind people would offer me their seat so I could sit down when I needed it. Hmm. Ahem. Hello, Peppa. 
I have a baby on my tummy and I'm very tired. So you need to give me your chair, please, Daddy. <laughs> Gosh. Righto, here you go. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> and sometimes my feet would hurt. So Daddy Pig would give me foot rubs. <gasps> Peppa likes the sound of foot rubs. Daddy, my feet are hurting. So I need to have a foot rub, please. Oh, well, not a moment to lose. Oh, oh. <laughs> a little here and a little Daddy Pig's foot rubs are more Mr. like foot tickles. <laughs> oh. There's one more thing that happened when Mummy Pig was pregnant. What was it? Eventually, Ooh. a baby came. Auntie Pig has brought baby Alexander for a visit. Hi, baby Alexander. I was pretending I had a baby oh. in my tummy. But now we can pretend that you're my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Real babies are quite noisy, actually. So I think I'll keep my cushion instead. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Pepper. Mummy Pig is dropping Pepper off at Playgroup. But Mummy Pig is also looking after Baby Alexander. Ooh, my. Mind if I clean up Alexander's smelly nappy before I go, Madam Gazelle? I insist. Oh, can we help clean him up? Please! <laughs> OK. Can you pass me the nappy cream from the changing bag and a fresh nappy? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes helping Mummy Pig change baby Alexander's nappy. There, fresh as a daisy. Can baby Alexander play with us? Please! Well, I don't see why not. Hooray! Peppa is showing baby Alexander all her favourite bits of the playgroup. These are the books. <laughs> Baby Alexander likes all the books. This is the whole world. <laughs> and he enjoys spinning the globe. <laughs> and this is Madame Gazelle. Bonjour, little Alexander. Oh! But he likes Madame Gazelle most of all. Uh -huh. <laughs> Perhaps it is time for some painting. <laughs> Everyone is painting pictures of themselves, Ooh. called ah. self-portraits. I'm Peppa Paint. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. I'm Freddy. <laughs> I'm Susie. <laughs> and I'm Gerald. <laughs> Well done, baby Alexander. It looks like a tasty apple. Baby Alexander's painting has reminded <laughs> Peppa that it's time for lunch. It's baby Alexander's mm. lunchtime too. He's eating special food for babies. Here comes the train, Alexander. Choo-choo! <laughs> Is baby Alexander's food nice, Mummy? He thinks so. Oh. oh, my. Mind if I clean Alexander up again before we head off? I insist. I'll get the bag. Oh, it's gone. Everyone loves having baby Alexander at playgroup. And baby Alexander loves visiting. Today, Peppa and her family have come to London to watch Super Potato, the musical. Goodness, we'd better get walking or we'll miss the start of the show. Oh no, we're going to get all wet. Not to worry, we can take the underground train instead. Hooray! The underground train is underground. <laughs> it never rains underground. <laughs> and there is a colourful map that shows where all the trains go. It looks like spaghetti. <laughs> So, we are here, and we need to get here. We can take the blue train first, and then 
take the red train. Yes, well done, Pepper. Off we go. First, Pepper must have her ticket checked by the ticket barrier. <laughs> Thank you, ticket robot. I'm stuck. Hold tight, Pepper. I'll get you out. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This way, Pepper. Follow the blue line, everyone. Um, I'm stuck too. <laughs> The train is arriving at the platform from a very dark tunnel. The train is very, very busy. Why is everybody rushing? They are in a hurry. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. On we go. Watch your step, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard the blue train. Mind the doors. Hold on, Pepper. The underground train is very bumpy. <laughs> on your left, you'll see under the ground. And on your right, you'll see even more under the ground. Change here for the red train. The red train? That's us. Watch your step, George. Hold tight, everyone. <laughs> we're here, we're here. The show starts in a few minutes. We might miss the beginning. Oh, no, you won't. Follow me. I'll get you to Super Potato the Musical on time, or my name isn't... Super Potato! Hooray! <laughs> Big celebrity coming through! Make way for the star, thank you! <laughs> no autographs today! Super Potato is in a hurry, too. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. Grandpa George, where are you? <laughs> Today, Pepper is playing in the garden with George and Grandpa Pig. <laughs> What's that noise? <laughs> I found you! Pepper has found George and Grandpa Pig in a bush. <laughs> it's so cosy in here. Yes, reminds me of the garden den I had as a boy. Can we make a garden den, Grandpa? Yes, indeed. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone is wearing special gardening gloves and boots ah. to make the garden den. <laughs> First, we need to dig a hole with these spades and get lots of sticks and twigs. Peppa loves digging the hole with Grandpa Pig. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, um, well done, Pepper. And George loves <laughs> gathering sticks. <laughs> I think that's enough sticks. Well done, George. Now Grandpa Pig is hammering the sticks into the hole. Stand back, everyone. <clears throat> <clears throat> Finally, Grandpa Pig makes a roof out of sticks. And Pepper and George cover the roof in lots of leaves. <laughs> Why do we need the leaves, Grandpa? They keep the den nice and warm. Look safe and sound. <gasps> well done. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> You'll need this before we go in, Pepper. Grandpa Pig has given Pepper a special backpack. <laughs> Everyone is very happy with their new garden den. Um, Grandpa, what do we do in the garden den? My favourite thing to do in a den is have a <gasps> picnic. The special backpack is full of fruit from the garden. Pepper and George love having a picnic in the garden den. Mm. Pepper, oh. George, where are you? <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> 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 
Everyone loves having a picnic in the garden den. Today, Pepper and George are going for a picnic with Granny and Grandpa Pig. Nearly there! It's Pepper's first time being in charge of packing the picnic. Are you okay, Pepper? I need to bring all my toys for the picnic, but they won't fit. Hmm. Do you need all of your toys? Uh, I know. I can just bring Teddy instead. Dinosaur! <laughs> and dinosaur. Wonderful. We won't have space for the food if we bring all your toys. What kind of food would you like to make for the picnic, Pepper? Oh, let's make spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Spaghetti is not very good picnic food. How about sandwiches? I love sandwiches too. <laughs> what is your favourite kind of sandwich? Jam! <laughs> Peppa, George and Granny Pig are making Yay! jam sandwiches. Will we need anything else for the picnic, Peppa? Um, we need a comfy picnic blanket. Can you find one, Grandpa? Aye, aye, Peppa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Making jam sandwiches is very messy. And cleaning the mess has made an even bigger mess. Not to worry. You can't make jam sandwiches without getting a little jammy. <laughs> Pepper's sandwiches are triangles. Ta-da! And George's are dinosaurs. <laughs> Got the blanket. Need anything else, Pepper? Hmm. We need cups for our orange juice. Well done, Pepper. Looks like we're ready to go. This is going to be so oh. much fun. Oh no, it's raining. Picnics are not as fun in the rain. Oh dear, I think our outdoor picnic will have to wait, oh. Pepper. Oh. But why don't we have an indoor picnic instead? Yay! Peppa has set up her picnic indoors. Now we can have a picnic even when it's raining. And all my toys can come too. Picnic! <laughs> Everyone loves Peppa's picnic and Peppa loved packing it for them. <gasps> that car went really fast. Don't worry. This is why it's very important to stop, look, listen, and always wait for the green man before crossing the road. The green man! Remember what we learned, children? Stop! Look and listen. All clear. No cars. Let's go. It's safe to cross now. Peppa and her playgroup are learning about road safety today. Hello, Daddy. Hello, Peppa. Peppa's playgroup. Hello, Daddy Pig. Oh, green light. Well, see you later, Peppa. Thank you for helping us, Police Officer Panda. All in a day's work. Pepper is helping Police Officer Panda make sure everyone follows road safety rules. No, no, no. Emily, you need to stay on your side of the road. Sorry, Pepper. My wheel is stuck. We'll come help you. Wee-oo, wee-oo, wee-oo. <laughs> We're keeping the road safe for cars and people. <gasps> Pedro hasn't noticed that Green Man has turned to red. Pedro, the red man means don't walk. <laughs> Thanks, Peppa. All in a day's work. 
Wait a minute. Freddy is dressed as a robber. We have to catch the robber. Wee-oo, wee-oo, wee-oo. Oh, the red light means stop. There he goes. Now we've got him. Freddy, are you dressed as a robber because you are a robber? No, I just like stripes. Oh, so you're not a robber? Nope. Oh, well, you can go then, but not so fast. OK, bye, Peppa. Ooh. Great work, Officer Peppa. Everyone is remembering to stop, look and listen and only walk when they see... The Green Man! That means we can go! All in a day's work, Officer Panda. Peppa loves keeping everyone safe and everyone <laughs> loves feeling safe. <laughs> <laughs>